Three women go down to Mexico one night to celebrate college graduation. They get drunk and wake up in jail, only to find that they are to be executed in the morning, though none of them can remember what they did the night before. The first one, a redhead, is strapped in the electric chair and is asked if she has any last words. She says, I just graduated from Trinity Bible College and believe in the almighty power of God to intervene on behalf of the incident. They throw the switch and nothing happens. They all immediately fall to the floor on their knees, beg for forgiveness, and release her. The second one, a brunette, is strapped in and gives her last words. I just graduated from the Harvard Law School, and I believe in the power of justice to intervene on part of the incident. They throw the switch, and again, nothing happens. Again, they all immediately fall to their knees, beg for forgiveness, and release her. The last one, a blonde, is strapped in and says, Well? I'm from the University of Texas and just graduated with a degree in electrical engineering. And I'll tell you right now, y'all ain't gonna electrocute nobody if you don't plug this thing in. <laughs> Tired of constant blonde jokes, a blonde dyes her hair brown. Then she goes for a drive in the country and sees a shepherd herding his sheep across the road. Hey, shepherd, if I guess how many sheep are here, can I keep one? The shepherd is puzzled, but agrees. She blurts out, 352. He is stunned, but keeps his word and allows her to pick a sheep. I'll take this one, she says proudly. It's the cutest. Hey lady, says the shepherd. If I guess your real hair color, can I have my dog back? A young ventriloquist is touring the clubs, and one night, he's doing a show in a small club in a small town in Arkansas with his dummy on his knee. He's going through his usual dumb blonde jokes when a blonde woman in the fourth row stands on her chair and starts shouting. I have heard enough of your stupid blonde jokes. What makes you think you can stereotype women that way? What does the color of a person's hair have to do with her worth as a human being? It's guys like you who keep women like me from being respected at work and in the community and from reaching our full potential as a person. Because you and your kind continue to perpetuate discrimination against not only blondes, but women in general. And all in the name of humor! Ventriloquist is embarrassed and begins to apologize when the blonde yells, You stay out of this, mister! I'm talking to that little idiot on your knee.